Hey everybody, from a breezy northwest forest, you might be able to hear this tree squeaking against a big branch overhead here. <laughs> it sounds like I'm on some big old 18th century ship. I love those little sounds of nature. Honestly, I've become really obsessed with the tiniest of details in the audio world of nature since starting the wild, and I, I just love it. It's, it's, it's noticeable how much more I'm noticing every little detail, and it's, it's really nice. It brings the place to life, especially in the spring. It's definitely sprung here for sure. The nettles are knee-high, and, and the birds are all singing and in love. The bears are coming out, and uh, I, yeah, I love this season. I hope you're enjoying it too, wherever you are, at least in the Northern Hemisphere. And heading into fall, for those of you in the Southern Hemisphere, I hope you had a good summer. So, I just wanted to let you know that we're taking a short break, a very short one, to work on some new episodes, all part of Season 3. We just got back from an incredible trip recording in California for two really good stories. One of them on California condors, North America's biggest bird that almost became extinct. You'll meet some of the amazing people that are making sure that that doesn't happen. And another one, island foxes on the Channel Islands off the coast of California. And this one's a bit of an ecological house of cards. It involves golden eagles, bald eagles, foxes, and pigs, of all things. Yeah, work that one out. Um, And then also still to come in season three, cicadas, which are on everybody's mind right now, brood X, orangutans, and even a snake that makes a noise. One of the very few snakes that you could do a podcast about, and that's the rattlesnake. So some great stories still to come. So we'll be back in June, which means that now is the perfect time, if you haven't listened to past episodes, uh, including my trip to Belize, and stories on ravens, caribou, and more. All right, that's it from me for now. Keep well, everybody, and stay in touch. Take care.